friends, I'm Shweta and welcome to Shweta Zizi Kukum channel. Today, we will be making potato smileys. Friends, you can go and buy them easily from the market. But the joy of making these smileys at home is totally different. And also, as a doctor, I never recommend buying packaged stuff from the market. Especially because they contain all types of preservatives in it. Be it class 1, class 2, class 3. These preservatives are carcinogenic. Hit the like button and subscribe my channel for more updates on easy and healthy cooking. So let's see the ingredients. These are boiled potatoes. This is half a cup of poha. I have soaked it in water for 10 minutes. This is 3 tablespoon of corn flour, half a teaspoon of chaat masala, salt and a pinch of garam masala. So now let's add all the ingredients to our potatoes. Here goes the chaat masala, salt, garam masala, soaked poha. This poha increases the crunchiness of our smileys. And in goes our corn flour. Now we will mix all our ingredients nicely. Now it's really important that we mash these potatoes fine. These finely mashed potatoes give a great texture to our smileys. Our potato dough is ready. Now we will just cover it up with a cling wrap and let it rest in the refrigerator for 15 to 20 minutes. It helps us in shaping the smileys. It has been 15 to 20 minutes. Now let's start with the magic. First I'll remove the cling wrap. This is a cookie cutter. This is a spoon to make the smile and a straw to make the eyes. Take a lemon sized ball of the dough, then roll it and flatten it a bit, just like this. If you want, you can grease your palms. Now give it a shape with a cookie cutter. If you don't have a cookie cutter, you can use a katori. Dust the straw with corn flour and make eyes. Same goes for the spoon. First dust it with corn flour. Then make a smile. And our first smiley is ready. Keep it aside on a plate and make all the smileys just like this. If you are planning to make them for a party, you can make them beforehand. You can just make them, dust them with corn flour and store it in the fridge. You can store them for 2-3 to three days. And whenever you want to eat them, just take them out from the fridge and fry them till golden brown. And enjoy your preservative free smileys. So now these smileys are ready to go in the kadai. Heat up oil in a wok and just fry these smileys till golden brown. See, our first smiley is done. You can see that these smileys are smiling a little more than those packaged ones. When you add these smileys to the kadai, keep the flame at high. After few seconds, reduce it down to medium and then fry it till golden brown. Our preservative free smileys are ready. Enjoy!